If you've been studying with me in the past, you, you know that I'm very keen on controlling color and tone for reproduction. And in Photoshop CS4, there have been some dramatic improvements, so much so that some of the techniques that I've taught in the past, I'm changing how those techniques are done today. And it's so much easier and so much faster. With this beautiful portrait created by Joseph and Louise Simone, what we would do with something like this, the problem is that the fingers and hand and arm are actually just a bit brighter than this beautiful face. So we want to make sure to tone down this region and make the face the, the lightest thing in the photograph. If you look how beautiful this image is, the hand really is screaming for attention. Well, in the past, we would do something very advanced, such as convert over to the LAB mode, take the lightness channel, burn that down, bring it back into Photoshop, create a snapshot back up in history, and do a back to the future history brush technique where we'd burn down the hand without generating a severe color crossover or any kind of color crossover. In Photoshop CS4, we have the ability to do something like that without generating a color crossover and without doing an advanced technique. So what I'm going to do is select the burn tool in Photoshop and if you remember from the extras on this DVD if you have looked at those at all there's a new feature called protect tones and also you might know that we use protect tones occasionally in a situation like this we can use protect tones to keep the color crossover from becoming a severe problem. So now I'm set to 50% exposure and when you burn down an area it's your wife's to try to do it all in one sweep of the mouse if that's possible and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to burn down this arm and you can see how beautiful it's doing and the fingers and it, it's maintaining the the color there's no color crossover but it did tone down the hands and, and fingers specifically. Look at this portrait now. Let's do a before and after and you can see now that the hand does not scream for attention and this beautiful face is now more prominent. So that is the Protect Tones feature which is in the option bar with the Burn tool.